Let's talk about banking documents. What is banking document? A banking document or a bank document refers to the various records, statements and forms that are generated and maintained by the bank during their operations. These documents serve as an evidence of, fin of financial transactions and providing important information about a customer's account, about a few and notable common bank documents. Number one, we have the bank statement. Bank statement. This is a periodic document that has been provided by a bank to an individual account holder, usually on a monthly basis. It lists or entails all the transactions made during the statement period, including deposits, withdrawals, cleared checks, and bank statements. Number two to note is deposit slip. I haven't gone to the bank before. A deposit slip is used by the account holder to deposit cash or checks into their bank account. It typically includes the account number of the individual person and account order's name, the date of performing the transactions, the deposit, the amount to be deposited, and a breakdown of cash and checks that is being deposited. Number third point to notice is withdrawal slip. The withdrawal slip is used to request cash withdrawal from a bank account. The slip includes details such as the account number account holder's name, the date, withdrawal amount, and the signature of the account holder. A fourth point to note is the check book. A check book can printed checks that account holders can easily use to make payments. And each check typically includes the account holder's name, the account number, the bank's name, and the bank's logo. The check number, date, payee's name, and the amount to be paid are also included. Number fifth item is bank draft. A bank draft is a payment made by a bank on behalf of a customer. It's similar to a check, but it is guaranteed by the bank itself. And bank drafts are often used for a, a very, very large transactions or when a payee requires a, a guaranteed form of payment. Number six is electronic fund transfer. This electronic fund transfer is um, also known as EFT form. The EFT form is used to authorize the bank to transfer funds between bank accounts. It includes details such as the account numbers involved the amounts to be transferred, and any other specific instructions or kind of references. Number seven point is letter of credit. Letter of credit in this instance is a document that is being issued by a bank that guarantees payment to a beneficiary upon the fulfillment of a certain conditions upon him. And it is commonly used in international trade to, to ensure that payment will be made to the exporter once the goods are delivered successfully. Number eight points to note is a bank guarantee. Bank guarantee is a document issued by a bank to guarantee the performance or obligations of a party. And the bank guarantee assures the recipient that the bank will compensate for any financial loss in the case the party fails to fulfill the obligation of upon him or her. Loan agreement, which is the number nine point. When a customer borrows money from a bank, a loan agreement is executed because it outlines the terms and conditions of the loan, including the amount, the loan amount, the interest rate, repayment, repayment schedule, and any collateral or guarantees required. All the above mentions are, are just a few examples of a bank statement. And the specific document provided by bank, it may sometimes varies based on services they offered 
and the jurisdiction in which they operate.